the right. conversation is very, is very interesting. Uh, my name is Habib Omar. Uh, I'm a community organizer, uh, public noisemaker to be precise. I make a lot of noise because our silence kills. And uh, definitely, maybe let me start by saying that I'm very uh, skeptical about um, even the press statement being given by religious leaders. I feel like it's a scheme by Zakayo just to ensure that we do not rise again. And um, because church speaks for, for us as the people. They've been silent for the longest period of time. So definitely, I'm not one person who is buying into that aspect. Until that point and uh, the time that we'll be able to see church leaders on the street leading the process, calling out, being categorically calling that wawe ni muizi. I'm a Ruto watcha kuwa vijana. I'm a watcha stop abducting young people and all that. Then we will be able to believe church. Um, maybe just coming to uh, Samuel Kasaure. You see, Thomas Sankara actually uh, warned us um, against being uh, potential criminals because a soldier without ideology is a potential criminal. And definitely, I don't know if Samuel is a potential criminal or what are some of the values, what are the values, what are the principles that you stand for? What is that one thing that you stand for as a young leader that you are ready and willing to die for, that you can be known for? And then secondly, you have talked about us uh, joining political parties, which I agree it is good for us to be able to join various political party because that is a tool that we can be able to mobilize and capture power with. But may I ask, do we have political parties in this country? Do we really? Do we? we have do we have political parties or do we have uh, tribal affiliations or maybe personal tool to be able to make business, do business? Do we have political party? Because at the center of the political party must be the interest of the people. Tell me which political party, yes, ODM stands for democracy, they didn't democracy. Does it really work in ODM? How many people have been short changed during party nomination processes? Who in ODM or UDA today can be able to challenge Raila Molodinga? Kasamuel, you are saying that you're going to bring change within ODM. Can you be able to challenge Raila and tell him, no, we do not want Adani because he was in support of it? Can you? Because we need to be realistic. This is one person at the end of the day. We, we were surprised because for, for the longest, and we wanted to call Raila for who he is. We appreciate the work he has done, the sacrifices he has made. But for how long are we going to pray for that price tag? Because he was a liberator, he stood firm, he was a social, social justice advocate. Then now we just, everything he says and he does is okay, that we cannot be able to challenge and question. And today you want to tell us that ODM is the biggest political party. What ideologies, what, what is it that they stand for? That today we have lost young people who are killed, people are being abducted. Right now you're just, you're just walking around the street, but you have fear. You fear for your life. For us, I will be able to tell you, for example, I serve at Karubangi Social Justice Center. And these things, we run with our own coin. Sometimes you help someone, other. it's that same, same person who is going to be able to abuse you and maybe even attack you. But you serve within that community. Sometimes we use our own pocket money. And we have been there. So at the end of the day, is it? At the end of the day, we need to be able to challenge ourselves as young people that we'll never allow ourselves to be allured by the essence of maybe gaining power, popularity, and all that. It's all about aspiration. It's all about standing for something. And that is why some of us, we are, we are very spectacle about you and because you are very promising. You did what you could be able to do. But right now, we think that you're just a potential I was very criminal. promising as what? <clears throat> you see... You came into limelight and all that because you had that determination. And in between, young people actually believed in you. But definitely at this point in time, we, we don't know because you have joined the oppressor. They believed you have in joined you for what? That's what I, I, I honestly want to ask. Yes, they question. believed in you for because what? of what you stood for. You what, see, Is there something you believe I stood for that I have uh, recently You stood betrayed? for what is right. We were fighting to be able to realize change in this country. Things were not right. And we thought that at the end of the day, you have identified, we have identified ourselves with you because we've been in this struggle for a very long time, you see. 
But at the end of the day, we feel disappointed as young people. And we have to tell you this, and that is why I'm asking, what do you stand for as a, as, as a young person? Are you a potential criminal? What are some of the values that you believe in? Because Thomas Sankara actually warned us against being, uh, 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 being potential criminals. I feel, like, I feel like that's an, it's a question that puts you in a corner. But I can get myself out of that corner. You've been in activism for how long? So for the last 10 years, you have been consistently fighting for the people. So it means you're well grounded in ideology. I will not ask you what it is, right? The area MC, MCA, from where you come from, is he better educated politically than you are? No. Your area MP, is he better politically educated than you are? <laughs> How comes then you are not in that position? You've been doing it for 10 years. You've been trying, right? Have you vied for, for the thing? You've tried and so the Kenyans did not, did not, yes, they, they, they made a choice, right? It's a thing which I was asking myself when I was, uh, because I've come into this activism space as a fairly new figure. It's a fight I've been having with the people saying that what is our alternative to the 500 shilling note? No amount of ideology. Sankara worked because he took power, right? Because right now, and I've asked you what you believed in me for, you can't even tell me. You just feel like, ah, no, this man has disappointed us because he's joined ODM. But the question you've asked me, you should have said, because I've consistently said these are the things that I've been fighting for. The three things all of us have been fighting for. Good governance, accountability in government, and lack of corruption. I have donated my body to the streets this entire year. You're talking about pocket money. Until now, and this is a day which I saw today, I even was doing something on socials, I have not received a single cent from government. When we were at the height of protest, Liliambi Wanilete list, I, I could have joined this government. I've had several opportunities. As we speak, being told now you can give us names of people you want to be nominated to members of uh, committees and uh, chairmen of, of, of committees. The reason why I still work like this is because, and why I've not really beefed up security, is because I believe the only thing I have is my coat, my vest of, of morality. And as you ask the things I stand for, and, and why you would say, are there political parties? I'll take you back to 2022 then. We have a lot of political parties. We have, let's talk about the parties in the left. Name them. We have Ukweli Party, yes? We have Communist Party of Kenya. We have, yes, we have United Green Movement. We have RSL. We have uh, Chama Chama Pinduzi Kweli. PRP, all Africans people. Oh, you see, a lot of these parties, and I know people who want to spark debate, they signed an MOU with Kenya Kwanza, or they signed an MOU with Azimio. Am I lying? So, you guys refuse to form a political party now. Or if we form it, I refuse to join a party where I am the party leader, my classmate is the party chairman, my group of boys is the, are the party officials. If I join ODM and I've said, I need you guys, Ukiskia Nasema join the Youth League, from my analysis, just the way you've decided to work with, like, for example, Karubangi Social Justice Center, and there's a particular goal which you're pursuing, I've done an analysis and seen, this is where my influence can work for the Kenyan people the most. A lot of the times, people don't attack me on ideology. They attack me on what they perceive I'm doing. So you tell me, I saw you in a photo with Osoro. I'm a famous guy now. Everyone wants a photo with me. Yeah. Two, and I, I, I wouldn't even be humble about it. It's true. Since I was a but we're not sour, not sour, not sour. I've I've paid I've paid for <laughs> internet <laughs> I've paid for our prizes, but I am not specifically saying that this is your best thing to do. But we cannot sit and become armchair revolutionaries. That all we want to do is write grants and proposals, go and do concerts, go and pick papers along riverbanks, and CG plant ninis, plant a few mbogas. Then one MP comes and says, Lalisha ikituyote. 
and in Alala. And you want to tell me that in this room, nobody has the potential to become an MP? Yeah, but all of you are very eloquent people, and you know, whichever political institute party you join, utapatiwa kiti as the youth person. Kwa nini tusi battle is a vitu out instead of being in a town hall? Because kama indu ingekua bunge, tungekua tumengusha finance bilama? Tungekua tumetua shi na sha? But, ikitu, tumelalia. NHIF, when they wanted to change it. This is a conversation that started in 2021. But tumekua tumelala, and then MPs, sitting MPs, who you pay from your pocket, now want to be activists. And then you want to blame it on a, from a, on a musician. Uh, Nisawa. Are you, are Nisawa. You, no, actually, uh, that's what I wanted to build on. Are yes. you able to, as part of ODM Youth League, yes. challenge Raila Amolo Odinga? What, on, on, give me a particular issue Adani. that I need to challenge. Adani. Very good. Very good. Sawa, sawa. Uh -uh. Uh, the, the, uh, let's, let's talk about Adani. Yes. I was, with the, I was with Baba the day before. I was with Baba the day before he spoke about Adani. And we had this really lengthy chat and he shows me photos of and, 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 and videos of them and, and the kind of work that the man has been doing and ta -ra -ra -ra. and he tells me this is why and I hear people are talking about Adani Gate and I tell him, yeah, I think uh, I just don't see how this, how the, I, I don't see how this man is good for the country. I sat with Adani, no, 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 I'm talking about Adani. This is, no, no, I didn't sit with Adani. I he sat, sat with, with Raila, told him. The right old honorable Raila and told him, this is what I think about Adani. I'm still here right now. I'm still in the youth league. Kwanzaa, that was even before I joined the youth league. That was, I think, a day after, that was on the Monday after Bomas. So in this thing for challenging, you sit and you say you cannot challenge Baba, but you've not dared sit with him. You refuse to sit with him. All of us refuse to sit with him. And it's the same way, for example, I am not here, for example, to change what he thinks. I am here to change Kenya. If this is the vehicle I have identified, for example, we usually go to a ballot and you say, I vote against this man, I vote against this. And this, I'm also subjecting myself to it happening to me. In 2027, Mutasema, I I am not entering this political party to serve the right honorable Raila Odinga. Even he did not create that party to serve himself, if you read the constitution of the party. I am entering this as a political, as a tool that will help us to take political power. I just don't want to sit in a town hall meeting and we have the most robust debates. And then when we go out there, there's someone who's going to piss on the essence of this whole debate. Let me, let me just push back and ask, with what you said, you challenged him in private. Right. Are you able to 